Well, um, I've successfully uh, done in another pair of sunnies at last night's radio. That's one pair at Weeper, one pair at Georgetown radios. So I've got a uh, full scratched, can barely see out of the sunnies on today. Not too bad for a five hour drive. Anyways, off to uh, Karumba where I'm all set. I'm over my tanny from before and I'm gonna catch a barra. I can just sense it. In big town, Georgetown, and I got myself a new set of sunnies already. Yep. Big gun parking up with Shazza. All right, well, I'm back in the land of uh, friendly people where everyone gives you a wave, so better get this on. Ready for my Russell Coit. G'day. And plenty of them. on my plate after a bit of an ordeal. So windy here. Kept losing me bloody cruskets. They just blew away. Anyways, now they've got a bit of weight on them, so hopefully I won't lose any more. Well, not far back there, I saw a sign saying, welcome to Carpentia. Don't even know how you say that. I think that's how you say it. You know what that means? I'm officially in golf country. Yeah, boy. So all day today while I've been driving, I've found this cool little trend that seems to be happening out here in the golf. And that is people are dressing up ant hills. I've seen everything from work shirts, ninja turtle eyes, um, bras, normal shirts, yeah, everything. So I decided that I might do my contribution and dress one up. And considering the uh, trend that's been going on with me, I feel that this one's quite appropriate. Right, got a uh, flogged out set of jocks. Yes, they are mine. I'm gonna do a dump and burn on an ant hill. Minus the dump part. Even managed to find one with two peaks, so it's like a couple of legs. There we go. They fit perfect. And just and hill decoration slash dump and burn. That bloke is insane. So hot.
definitely not the biggest fan of birds, but even I can say how cool is that. I don't know what they are, I think they're like storks or something. But whatever they are, there's heaps of them. Pretty cool. See, we're going to have a repeat here of the cows and they're all going to bugger off on me, but I'm going to try and get a photo.